Hey yo, what up fam? You know what it is, man. We are back with another video. Yes. And today it's a little bit different. It is a thank you video to you guys. Uh, we finally hit 13,000 subscribers, man. That is a milestone. Every thousand is a milestone. And for us, we never thought we'd even hit 13,000. When we hit 10K, we were like, yo, that's insane. For us to get 3,000 more subscribers, which is a, such an amazing community. As you guys can tell, it is a Q&A video. So we're here to answer them. And uh, you guys get to learn a little bit more about ourselves. So, right. Yeah. And I think it's the best way to kind of um, interact with you guys a little bit more. I know you guys came here to subscribe uh, for the videos that we react to. And honestly, for us as uh, content creators, we actually want to put the creative side to the creator, I guess. We we want to be more than just, you know, your, your average reactor. We are doing YouTube for one reason only, and that's to entertain you guys and you know if you guys are having a bad day we'd like to be the reason why you know we got a little yeah. bit better you know it's it's a place where you guys can come and just forget about all the stuff that's going on with your day we did have another channel um that's where we did like mostly um like challenges and stuff like that yeah and uh we did a q a there uh but it was way like you know way long it ago, was a long time ago. Yeah. it was like a 400 subscriber yeah and looking back to that it was this crazy man to really think that we hit 13,000 on this channel I know. it's crazy for the first question what is your favorite voice play song performance that you have reacted to and this was a uh, a question by Dylan um what was your favorite one my favorite so far um would have to be uh oogie boogie Oogie Boogie? Yeah, Oogie Boogie. <laughs> That's the one with the Nightmare Before Christmas. Mm -hmm. By the way, I have not checked out Nightmare Before Christmas. He um, has to. I will. I will. I promise. I I, know, I saw a comment that said, uh, how was it? Uh, so. Oh. <laughs> yeah, so uh, to answer yeah. your question, I have not I checked it out. I haven't seen it. For me, um, I, I, I'd like to say Warriors. Warriors? The most recent one that we did. By the way, if you guys want to check that out, it'll be up here. But for Warriors, I felt like everyone was able to kind of showcase their talent so uh i like warriors a lot bobby burton 16 if you guys did not know uh bobby burton has been a long-term subscriber um so they asked oh they said so glad to see the channel grow like this thank you been with you guys a minute now i was one of your first shout outs i hope you plan on more ptx yes we are i know there's a couple more that we need to do um so his question was you ever listen to eminem and yes yeah <laughs> yes uh don't break me don't make me rap <laughs> uh eminem was actually one of my favorite rapper i know people will say that i just grew up listening to eminem and i remember mockingbird and um when i'm gone that's like the song that i actually know the oh lyrics God, to this... uh it's been a while so it's been a really but he is really good like yeah. he is talented super talented yeah. so shout outs to you bobby burton 16 yes you are and you were one of the first shout outs and i'm glad you're still here stason asks will you both be reacting to the one piece anime just came across your channel from one piece opening and have been enjoying all this the reactions so far Aww. Thank you. Yes. <laughs> the answer to your question is yes, we will be reacting to uh, more One Piece anime. Uh, I think right now the m the main uh, problem is that we don't know where to stream it. I was thinking Crunchyroll. Yeah. So um, yeah, we'll we'll do more One Piece. The the more you guys kind of like, I think we just right now we're just going by like every request. So the more requests, like the more One Piece request comes in the more we'll put them in. We have a whole list, so we'll put them in a list, mm -hmm. and, you know, we'll do them. So the more you guys comment on One Piece, the more we'll do them. So yeah. if you guys want to check out our One Piece opening, by the way, we'll be up here. If you guys didn't know, I work in an after-school program. So uh, one of them is from my student, uh, from Armelo12. That's their Instagram. Uh, can I be on Yellow Team? <laughs> they probably don't know what that means. So you yeah, so... uh. <laughs> 
what they mean is that where I work at, we have this event every year where we draft our kids and they represent our color. It's kind of like an NBA like draft thing where we do like different challenges for the kids and um, they get drafted to a team with like representing your color and my color is yellow and that's like my favorite color if you guys didn't know uh i am the basically the staff for yellow team and a lot of students will you know ask like can i be on your team can i be you know especially if you have a connection with them and i do have a connection with this student and um so the question to that is i would love to have you on my team but if you know another staff like happen to draft you then that's out of my power man but <laughs> i would love to have you on my team i know uh, one of the staff really wants you on their team as well so but yeah I, I would love to have you <laughs> yeah. on my team here's a question from one of my former students uh db vangsta um and he asks what's your favorite food favorite show favorite movie and how's quarantine all right what's your favorite food i would go with sushi I'd have to go with sushi too. <laughs> I love sushi. Sushi, or if I was to go for my go-to, it would be for uh, maybe a burrito would be good. A burrito? A burrito. Would be good. It's a go-to, like a quick one. Like a quick go-to? Yeah, just like if if you can't get sushi, I'll well, be like the secondary. I'd get a uh, wing stop. Oh yes. Wing stop. Yes, I'll yes. take that back. Wing uh, stop. Wing stop. <coughs> mango habanero with honey mustard oh my god yes <laughs> that is so good uh if you guys have not tried that honestly try mango habanero from wingstop and uh honey mustard best combination ever right best. yeah that's that's actually a combination i came up with at least personally i would say favorite show my favorite show uh hands down has to be lucifer oh, she's not the devil i am De oh, 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 oh. There you go. I love the game of um, If you guys have not seen that show, I think they still have it on Netflix. They um, they're going to come out with a new season. And oh, my God, it is so good. Um, if you guys like like if you guys like detective slash like some kind of comedy in there, you guys are going to like this show. I would go with BMS, Blue Mountain State. If you drop your cookie, you lose. And the losers, a.k.a. you a-holes will have to eat your cookies but it was on netflix for a while and yo i watched the every single episode it's like so funny four five yeah. six times man it's it's crazy favorite movie see this is a hard one well like if you just say movie like what would be the one that comes to my head first yeah mine would be Step Brothers. oh Hands down. don't at me if you okay. do don't at me if you do at me at yves and daisy Oh, Lego actually, yes, I love that movie, but I believe, like, honestly, my favorite movie, and this, you probably don't like it, but it has to be Daddy's Home. Daddy's Home? Yeah, anything mm. Daddy's Home, Daddy's Home 2, I love, like, you know, because it, it gives me, like, a Christmassy vibe. How are we doing during this quarantine? Chill and bored. Um, For me, eh, yeah, somewhat chill and obviously bored because, you know, we can't do anything. Right. Uh, but we are working from home, so like obviously we have to be productive, and actually we've been really, actually we've been pretty busy lately. Yeah. So because we're trying to put a lot of videos out for you guys, so um, yeah, actually, yeah, you guys keep us busy, and that's what keep us not being bored. Yeah, I, uh, honestly, maybe I'll take the bored back because I'm actually enjoying making these videos for you guys. I uh, try to do a little bit of uh, working out in the garage. But other than that, that's about it, man. It's, just, it's the same routine, you yeah. know? A question from Katie. She asked, uh, your daughter wants to know when are you going to propose? Oh, my God. Oh, I forgot another one that's kind of similar to that. One of my friends, Marisol, asked, uh, when are you getting married? Okay, so... so it's kind of like the same thing, same question. Um, honestly, there's, like, no date or just going on with you know the flow yeah. i think once we're financially like stable uh because um i don't want to go through and planning things out knowing that it's like we're on a budget right you so, know like, like i've seen so many motivational videos 
where um they say that you don't have to have your life planned like at a certain age like yeah. let's say 25 right you don't have to have your life planned at 25 right. um it could be at 30 or whatever you know like just go with the flow if you have something a dream or whatever follow that dream marriage isn't something that we really talk about yet mm-hmm. and um and uh, honestly like I think it's just so fun to just be in a relationship without thinking about like oh, let's yeah. have a kid soon or like let's get married and like kind of settle down you know mm-hmm. um i think we're really just more focused on just pushing like what we really want to do and where we want to be in the future where we can financially like be comfortable you know mm-hmm. we don't have to be like the richest people but like where you're financially financially like comfortable mm-hmm. you know what i mean marla rodriguez um how old are you guys oh lord jesus how old are you babe question is how old do we look comment that down below please <laughs> <laughs> um i am 27 years old dang you old <laughs> turning 28 i look young though i look super young i look like i'm <laughs> um i look like i'm 18 some people think i'm 18 man i am how old am i liar <laughs> <laughs> i am 24 years old turning 25 this year please say I am that turning 25 <laughs> this year yeah but it's not till like october so i'm more yeah you're barely halfway 30 i'm already like going towards 30 oh my god that's scary <laughs> Lord, <Jesus Christ. laughs> question from joseph one of my former students again um favorite shoe brand what's your favorite shoe brand my uh, adidas Hey, Adidas right here. Yeah. Um, I'm going to say it now, and you guys heard it here first. Adidas will be maybe the biggest shoe brand in the future. Yeah. It like, will. It, they're on a come up. Like their style and like just like their colorway, super hands-on. They're really, really good. And I feel like they've, they've been getting much better. Yeah. But um, yeah, Adidas. Anything Adidas. I love anything Adidas. I'd say like five years from now. I'm telling you. You yeah. heard it here first. Um adidas will be the top brand shoes leah his sister asked uh how did you meet how did i meet you mm. <laughs> how did we meet baby how let did them we know meet? uh we met on instagram fam we did but we did go to the same school uh i know who he was he just didn't know who i was why weren't you looking uh, at me you never gave me attention at school. Uh, I was dating someone at the time. Come I'm just on, kidding, man. Why didn't you give me attention? Because I don't know. Why don't you that. hit me up? <laughs> Why were you going to say no to me the first day we went on a date? Oh, stop it. Uh, your sister asked, how did you come up with your doggy's name? Um, if you guys did not know, we do have two dogs. Right. Uh, we have a husky and we have a chihuahua slash uh, Jack Russell. And um, the husky's name is uh, Onyx. Onyx. How do we come up with that name? Um, when we when we went to go when we bought him from like his original owner, mm-hmm. they already named him Onyx. Well, they haven't given him a name yet. They, but no, that, his name no, was Onyx. I know, but like they didn't give him a name yet. To, would be when we picked them up. It was that um that that last uh, payment that we did for him we went to go pick him up and then they told us that they started calling him onyx and then they asked us if, he, if we want to keep that name or um if we wanted to change it and obviously we had to be you know honorable and we just kept that name for you know them cause well if that was the case I, we could have just changed it i thought all this time his name was onyx no they told us we could change the name they just started calling him onyx. yeah no they told us that yeah. yeah but i thought when they first had him i thought when they were you know they they trained oh, okay. him and everything i thought he was going by onyx, onyx already right no right so yeah we just kept onyx his original name was going to be mellow mm-hmm. yeah after mm-hmm. You know, the anime character from Seven Deadly Sin, Meliodas. Um, and Dobie, the little chihuahua slash Jack Russell. Oh, God, this is this <laughs> the dopest. This is the dope. Like, it's so dope how we came up with the name. And he was like, let's call him Dobie. And if uh, you guys don't know why we, well, the only reason why we named him that is because um, <laughs> he looks like Dobie from Harry Potter. The elf. The elf, yes. And he was so cute. <laughs> So Leah asked, what is your favorite Filipino dish? Um, what's your favorite Filipino dish? 
I'd 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 go with uh Caldereta. Really? Yeah. Okay, it is good. Uh my favorite one would have to be Puchero. Okay. I that's love a, that. That's it's like basically our, like a it's like, like a, a beef stew kind yeah, of. Beef it's not stew. beef stew really. It's a little bit uh lighter than a beef stew. Um it's like a beef broth kind yeah. of thing. Yeah. That oh, it's so good, especially with like potato. Uh, I can't. <laughs> and oh my god, when it's like super warm, mm, I love that. My cousin Andrea asked um, if you could have any superpower, what would it be and why? That's um, that's a that's a crazy question. I never really thought about it mm-hmm. because it's like when you think about it, people would be like, I want I want to be able to travel like. Right. To the future, you know. Mm-hmm. I'll go with super speed. Like the flash. Like the flash? Why? Um, why? I don't know, man. I feel like I, mean, I can slow down time. Mm-hmm. Um, I can mm-hmm. I can get to you know, get to do things that I wanna do quickly. Okay. Uh it's just man, time. Time is just it's so valuable, bro. Like, yeah. we don't have enough time in the day, honestly. Mm-hmm. So, time for me is just, I wish I can go faster. Yeah. Yeah. What about you? Uh, mine would have to be um, kind of like the power of being invisible. <laughs> Why? Why? Uh, because. You pervert. No, not like that. But, like, um, you know, like, you can just, you can do things and people wouldn't be able to see you <laughs> like what <laughs> like shopping not you're gonna shoplift <laughs> no not shoplifting but like you know or just money on your own business like be invisible or you can do that just stay at home <sighs> no you have to be out in the world to do stuff <laughs> like what <laughs> what can you do as being invisible yeah uh you can hide <laughs> you can't i don't know dude something's going on in your head bro <laughs> i don't know it seems pretty cool to me so johnny diaz asks what is your favorite anime i've only seen like two um but i like hunter x hunter hunter x hunter yeah wow. um for me i have I have multiple. Uh, it's it's because I haven't really seen a lot of animes. Really, it's just like kind of like the mainstream. But for me, is Naruto. Naruto. Yeah, it's just the story in that. I know there's a lot of other animes that are like, you know, that have good storylines. Mm-hmm. You know, I just I, I don't like the where it becomes super repetitive where you have the good guy, the strongest guy, fight a bad guy. Right. And, and it's the same thing. And over and over mm-hmm. again, you know, I like the storyline where they talk about the history and stuff. So, like, Naruto, for me, you know, Maybe it does it for me. Like, um, mm, that's why I like Hunter x Hunter. It's not, it's not just, like, you know, fighting scenes. They have to go through, like, some random challenges or whatever, you know? Yeah. So... Yeah, that's why I like so it. It's, it's cool. There's adventures in that. Yeah. Oh, my God. Uh, we butchered your name a long time ago. Uh, yeah. Leline Ducho. Um, by the way, shout outs to you. Thank you for, you know, introducing us to uh, Fran Trap. Uh, oh, appreciate yeah. that. Mm-hmm. Big Ollie or Big Flow and mm-hmm. Ollie. Thank you so much. But um, she asked, how did you get the idea of making videos? And when did you create your channel? By the way, love you. We love you as well. Thank you so much. Um, so it's a two-part question. Okay. How did you get the idea of making videos? <laughs> How I think it was in the old channel when we had, right? Yeah. Um, I think. Which one was the first video? It was the makeup, makeup blindfold makeup, yeah. right? It was her idea that she mm-hmm. wanted to do, and um, and we started from there. I think it was. I think you wanted to do it as your own channel. Yeah, I believe. <laughs> and then we just combined. And then yeah. we just decided we're going to do it anyways. Like, we'll um, just... yeah. But for me, like starting like the whole YouTube channel is um, I like filming. I like uh, and obviously like I learned uh, to edit through him because before it used to always be him editing. Yeah. Um, but just I don't know. I like filming. So that's how it started. 
Yeah, but the idea started from the whole makeup the blindfold makeup, makeup challenge. challenge. Yeah, which um, I think we still have it up. We do. <laughs> it didn't never hit a thousand. <laughs> And what, when when did you create your channel? The very first channel was about five five years ago, about four and a half years ago. Yeah. This channel was also created about f- three and a half years ago. It wasn't active till two years ago. Yeah. Because this was supposed to be the vlogging channel. Yeah. Yeah. Oh yeah, that is yeah. right. And then we decided like, hey, let's let's <coughs> kind of do reaction videos. Mm-hmm. And honestly, it was, it was like so far fetched because we were like. We're starting from square one because the last channel already had like 600 subscribers and we were like, dude, we're starting from square mm-hmm. one. You it know? was scary, like, because we didn't know if, it was, if this one's going to be like, you know, good yeah. or, you know, because we just literally kind of like go the other channel. Yeah. Um, but yeah, actively on this channel, we've been two years here for two years. So. Yeah. Matisse Roy asked, how long have you been together? How long? Tell me. If you remember, <laughs> four years and ten months. ten months. Yeah. So in May, what? May third. We're gonna be five years. Yeah. Five Crazy. Years. Time five years. flies. Honestly, yeah, it does man. not feel like it's almost been five years. Honestly, it feels like I've only known you for two years. Uh, my cousin asks, uh, Finster, um, asks, uh, that's his name on Instagram, by the way. Uh, what have y'all been up to during this crisis? We've already answered that. We've yeah. we we've been we've been filming, filming like crazy, editing, eating, sleeping. Yeah. Basically, that's yeah. the, that's the summary of it. But mostly, like we've been pushing a lot of videos. So basically, editing and filming. Right. So yeah. Uh, Lil Mayo the Cracker. That's his name on uh, on Insta- Instagram. Instagram. He does follow us on our um, Yves and Daisy, and he does follow me on. Thanks. I think he follows both of us. Yeah. Uh, he asks, what is one thing that makes your reaction channel different from others? Oh, I, I didn't think we were going to get this <laughs> question. What makes us different? What makes us different? I I, I think um, the variety of, of reaction channels nowadays, especially reacting to musicals, that there is a vocal coach. Oh, yeah. So many vocal coaches out there. You know, majority of them will, you know, they know what they're talking about. Okay, yeah. Most of the time when we go into these reaction videos, one, we don't watch it, so we don't mm-hmm. have time to plan out our reaction. And yeah. I think a lot of those reaction channels do watch the video before they even film it. All right. I'm I'm just gonna say it. Mm-hmm. Um but I think what makes us different is like most of the times we go into like the reaction videos or to the videos we're reacting to, we're going in blind. Right, we are. And um I think what makes us different um is that our reaction is probably as genuine as it gets. Mm-hmm. We do not watch the videos. Mm-hmm. You know, we don't have time to be like, hey, at this part, let's let's, let's kind of go crazy. Yeah. You know what I mean? Mm-hmm. It's it's more so um, just put it on, react to the video, mm-hmm. and you guys get, like, the genuine reaction. Mm-hmm. I think that's what makes us different. Yeah. Um, so uh, I actually like that question because it kind of brings us to, like, out of our comfort zone because mm-hmm. I think – to, to really grow further, we just have to be ourselves. Right. And, like, if we have something to say, like, just just talk our shit. If you, have to, <laughs> you know what I mean? Like, yeah. I, we're not holding, you know, anything back. So, thank you so much for, for asking that question because that really brings us out of our comfort zone. Okay, guys. Um, thank you so much for tuning in, man. Um, if you guys asked a question, thank you. Thank you guys so much for watching. Uh drop your request down below i think this is a time where you guys can go and drop your request down below uh we'll get to those we'll get to those reaction as soon as we could we do have a whole list of you know what we're gonna do next uh what videos we're gonna react to so for those of you guys that are you know waiting on your video check out some of the other videos that we do man um i'm pretty sure you guys are gonna enjoy some of them like you know we have a whole variety of talents out there um for all of my uh new community of animes like more videos are gonna come out trust me um we're really pushing these videos out for you guys so yeah this ends our q a uh we hope you really did enjoy it and if you did don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up that let us know that you did um if you guys want to see more q a's from us let us know down in the comments and 
I don't know, just let it know if you enjoyed it and you want to see more. Uh, don't forget to comment and subscribe for more videos and click on the notification bell to get notified every single time we upload a new video. Until then, guys, we'll see you guys next time. Salute. Bye.